want to get a party planner. What? A party planner. I thought I was going to be your party planner. Her name is Erica. She came out of a coffin. What? <laughs> Are you sure about this? <laughs> Trust me, guys. She's as crazy as I am. So we came up with some really good ideas. Oh, We're going to have to think about a budget. We all just need to shake it more, make more jingle noises. You know what I mean? That, that is, is so beautiful. Oh my god. Getting claustrophobic. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. So I ready to make money for my guitar? Yeah! So we're jumping up and down, screaming, people were honking. And all of a sudden, the unexpected happened. Do you like it? Uh, I look like a man. <laughs> and I live in Houston, Texas. It's not every day that a girl who turns 15 can have an excuse to have an over-the-top excuse. My party will set a new standard because people will never expect to see a crazy mix of dance, lights, and culture. My mom is Mexican and my dad is Salvadorian. And even though my sister and I were born in Texas, we are definitely Mexidorians. Kids, come in! So about the quinceanera, I don't want it to be normal quinceaneras. I want it over the top, like rave and light mm -hmm. and Indian. My mom is just as crazy as I am, and she does party decor for a living. So she's a perfect person to help me plan my party. I want it everything like go crazy in there. Define crazy. What do you mean crazy? Elephant crazy. Excuse me? Just sometimes I feel that my mom thinks I'm a bit more crazier than her. Even a camel, monkeys. <laughs> you know how expensive that's gonna be? The raver, the Hindu, is something that could be possible. But an elephant, that's going above and beyond. Okay, just think? Okay. I can't believe that nobody understands my vision. I know my ideas aren't crazy. I needed to find some help to get my thoughts organized. And after some research, I found the perfect person who I know will not think my ideas are insane. Erica, who had her quince a couple years back, seems like we have the same creativity. So I left our message hoping that she would get back to me soon. One thing I know for sure is that I love dancing and I'm going to do a bunch of dances for my quince. And one of them is crazy hip hop dance that's gonna be out of this world. The hip hop dance is coming out good, I'm excited. But we still need to find out what we have to wear. I think it should be something tough, but girly at the same time. Yeah, something that makes it stand out more than anybody. Well, I'll get Erica to help us out. Who's that? When I told my friends I was gonna get Erica to help me out, they were confused. I found her online, she already had her quince. Her quince was amazing, like she's creative. Oh my gosh, y'all need to meet her. Are you sure about this? <laughs> Once I told my friends who Erica was, they were still a bit sketchy. Trust me guys, she's as crazy as I am. Okay, well she's crazy like you, I trust you on that. <laughs> Now that Erica agreed to plan my game test, I had to find a way to tell my parents, especially my mom. All right guys, I want to talk to you about something. I want to get a party planner. What? A party planner. I thought I was going to be your party planner. You're doing the decorations, okay. and somebody else is helping me with the ideas. I want to get somebody that can like help me with giving me more ideas, you know, so my party can be huge. So I found this girl on the internet, her name is Erica. I just need that extra crazy spice for my quince. And I know that only Erica can help me out. What did she do that was so crazy that you want her to help you? She did a zombie quinceanera. Zombies? She came out of a coffin. What? That's yes, crazy. that is crazy. Everybody was as confused as expected. Can we at least invite her to the house so you can see what she's about? As long as me and your father have the last decisions and you don't go overboard and go crazy with this, we have no problems with it. We're all good with this, guys? Yeah. Exactly, We're all good? Yes. Now I just need to get organized with Erica and finally meet her. I hope it goes well. Everybody was pumped up, they ran with their signs, and tried to get some cars to get washed. And all of a sudden, the unexpected happened.
Today, I'm meeting Erica for the first time and I'm feeling so nervous. Oh my gosh, she's here! Finally, I heard a knock on the door. Erica's here! <gasps> and of course, it was Erica, all pinked out. Erica brought her mom, so it was an extra perfect. Come in, come in. Thank you. As soon as they walked in, we sat down and started with the kinsa plan. Oh my God, so tell me about your kinsa. Okay, so I went brave, Indian, colors, light. I just wanted to be, wow. Indian, like Hinduism Indian? or Like the pretty Indian belly oh, dance. Oh, like, that's gonna be so Hinduism. pretty. Once I told her what I wanted for my theme, she thought it was a great idea. And what about your grand entrance? My grand entrance? I was thinking an elephant. <laughs> Girl, they're gonna shoot that elephant before like you're able to like do your grand entrance. This is Texas. I love her already because she's in my point. No elephant. I thought for sure she was gonna be on my side for that one. I guess that was a little over the top. And your dress? Oh, you wanna go see it? Yeah, oh my god, yes. Once she told me she wanted to see my dress, we ran to my room. <gasps> oh my god, your dress is so pretty. I showed her my purple dress and she loved it. Girl, let's sit down and talk about your party. Something I really need help on is the costumes for the hip hop. Um, let's see, you could do Indian, like feathers, or maybe army. That'd be cute, like camouflage. Yeah, camouflage with the boots. And you can add like little accessories, like a hat or something. Dog tag. Or... Yes. So, is there anything else that I should know about your party? I want to try to get a flying carpet. Oh my God, we could get an Indian carriage. I think that'd be really, really oh, cool. Oh, yeah. And have like the guys be all dressing up and you could be there like the queen, you know? Erica gave me so many great ideas. I can't wait to start. After we went over everything I want for the quince, we went out to tell mom. Oh my God, we came up with some really good ideas. Oh, We're gonna have to think about a budget. Yes, like, uh, yeah, like a benefit or something. Something that we could do to raise money to pay for the, the actually just the like decor itself. Yeah. So what about a car wash? Oh my god, that'd be great because I had a car wash and we got like a buttload yeah. of money. So I think that'd be really, really great. I think it's perfect. Car wash. Car wash. That's perfect. Yeah. Okay, so we got everything set for the party planning. We're going to do the car wash to raise money and your party is going to be amazing. So I ready to make money for my guitar? Yeah! yeah. Let's wash some cars! Yeah. Today, I'm having a car wash. I just hope we can make some bank to buy some bling. So we're jumping up and down, screaming, people were honking. And finally, we got our first customer. But to our surprise, it was a huge old limousine. Get my limo walk. Can y'all take care of that? Yeah. Really? All right. Okay. All right. Thank you. Are we going to charge them $5 for all of this? This is one car. This is another car. And this is another car. That's about three cars total. But after that, more cars came and we started making some money. Come on guys, we gotta do a good job! But then all of a sudden, the unexpected happened. First it was a few drops of rain. But then it started pouring. Ah, lightning! Oh my God. Then we had to call it quits, but not before we started counting the money. So far guys, y'all have made $135. Oh my God! Oh, we did it! Do you like it? Uh, I look like a man. Really? <laughs>
After practicing the belly dance, Erica told me she had a surprise for me. I had no idea what it could be. I went along with it because a surprise with Erica will be worth it. Surprise! Oh, oh, you're so cute! Oh my god! <laughs> I couldn't believe what I saw. Some nostalgic ravers. They had furry boots, fog, lasers. These are cyber kids made on Mars. And basically, I got them to rave at your party. Oh, yeah. We're gonna check yeah. them out. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Much. Are you ready to check them out? Yeah. Definitely. We sat down so they could show us what they got. Musica Maestro. <laughs> Thanks to Erica and her friends, my kids is gonna be even better. Stop the music! Now I can't wait to see them dance on my kids. I hope they have what we want. I know, me too. Hopefully they'll have it. Now that I have my ravers, it's time to find my Indian dog for my belly dance. I wanted a flying carpet, but Erica had a great idea of having my guys carry me in on the Indian dog. I hope I find the perfect one to surprise my guests. <gasps> That's so pretty! Oh my gosh! The salesperson showed us what she had, and as soon as I saw it, I fell in love. That's, That's so beautiful. beautiful! Oh my god. You're getting claustrophobic. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> At least you weren't in a coffin, girl. Like, you not breathe in that. Sometimes I get freaked out in tight spaces. But being claustrophobic, it didn't stop me. So, can we get it? Yes, we did get yes. this. Okay, yes. yeah, because I love it. All right. All right. My party planning is coming together. And now, it's time to make sure my costumes, my decorations are getting done. Oh, it looks curved. I like it. You like it, like dog? Yes, it's pretty. Wait till I finish my masterpiece here. My mom, as a decorator, was making the centerpieces, and my dad, as a clothing designer, was making my LED costumes for my last dance. It's so cool. Whoa. Look, you could do something like that. Turn off the light. Everything has finally come together. I hope all our hard work finally pays off. Hi. Today's the day that I've been waiting for for so long. After I woke up, I got up from my bed and went to go do my hair and makeup. Let's get ready. I started with my makeup first. I wanted my makeup natural because I don't like a lot of makeup. Ready? So once I got all my makeup done, I looked at myself in the mirror. Do you like it? Uh, I look like a man. <laughs> no, I don't like it. I don't know. I just, my face doesn't go with it. I didn't like it at all. I felt like a drag queen. I'm just not used to seeing myself with a lot of makeup. You want it lighter? You the you want eyeshadow, lighter? kind of light. Lighter? Even though everybody was telling me that I look beautiful, I wanted some of that makeup taken. So she finally took off some makeup, and I felt a bit better. Thank you. Now it's time for my hair. Surprise! <laughs> oh, hey! As I was getting my hair done, Erica walked in. You look so pretty, oh Thank my you. god. But as you're getting out of Hunter, I decided that maybe we should spice something up. So, I got you a surprise. When she told me she had a surprise for me, I did not know what to expect. What is this? I got you glow in the dark neon Aww, scrubs that they're, they're gonna cute. be wearing. Mm -hmm. So, whenever the lights go off, you're gonna be able to see everyone cheering for you. Oh! When she showed me that she got me glow in the dark wristbands with my name on it, I thought that was a fantastic idea. They're so cute! You like them? Yes! I'm gonna take these with me, so by the time that you get there, everybody's gonna be having them. Okay! Okay! okay. Bye! Bye. Bye. I was so excited, I was pumping up the crowd even more. I felt like a rock star. My Kinsa Day is finally here. Finally, my hair was done, and it was time for the most important part. Moment of glory. Once you put the crown on me, I felt complete. Here you go, Mama. Thank you. Can you help me put on the dress? Yes. Now that my hair and makeup's done, it was time to put on my dress. Jeff, you look so beautiful. Get your dress on. Get your 
Let's get it on. Once I had my dress on, my mom and my sister had to tie the corset really tight. It's so beautiful. Calm down, but we are so we sentimental, I guess. When I saw both my sister and my mom getting emotional, I did not want to start crying because I know they would start crying even more. So I played it off. Let's go. The limo's here in the courts outside waiting. And now that I was completely ready for my kansas, it was time to get in the limo. As I walked out, I saw my court cheering for me. And I was feeling excited. I was just feeling all these emotions. So are you guys ready to party? Yeah! So we started dancing and partying all the way to the venue. We finally arrived to the venue. It was time to do my grand arrival. Hey you guys! Oh my god, you look so beautiful. Are y'all ready? Yeah. Okay, Steve, you, you can open up the, the sunroof. That way you can be waving to your guests. Okay. Alright? Erica came out and told me exactly what needed to be done. So I went up on the sunroof and I sat on top of the limo. As I was getting closer to the front of the venue, I could hear everybody screaming and cheering. I couldn't believe that they were all there cheering just for me. So you ready to party or what? Woo! And once I saw that everybody was cheering with the balloons, I knew that it was going to be a great night. I was so excited, I was pumping up the crowd even more. I felt like a rock star. Finally, it was time to do the second grand entry. Erica ran into the venue and got everything started. The princess of the night, Justine! I wanted my king to different, but of course, keep it tradition. First, it was time for the father and daughter. My dad, he means the world to me, and I love my dad. He's like, awesome. I was happy doing this dance because it's a memory for me and my dad that I will never forget. After the father and daughter dance, it was time for my dance. We went into the little room to change into our belly costume. We're going to do the belly dance right now, so we're all trying to figure out how we're going to change in front of each other. The Ravers did a spectacular performance while I was getting ready. Even though the guys and the girls had to change at the same time, I wasn't even worried about that. All I was worrying about is getting ready and getting dressed and trying to hurry up. The first thing I had to do was get inside the Indian dog. When I was in the dolly, I didn't even have time to feel claustrophobic. All I was doing was rehearsing the dance inside my head. Everybody started cheering, clapping. I felt really good. Until my belly skirt started falling down. I felt so scared. I didn't want it to fall and I couldn't really move as much as I wanted to. I didn't want to do the dance full out because I knew if I did, my skirt would fall down. Even though everybody was cheering and applauding, I really was still disappointed because I didn't do it full out. I messed up because my freaking thing was unloose. Oh my god. Even though I was disappointed, it was time to do the hip hop performance. I was more than ready. Hey yo, I pledge allegiance to money. This next love is eating. Scarface houses from eight ounces. Eyes name written on the covenant of I was happy how I was performing, how my court looked with all the army costumes and everything. It just all came together and it looked perfect. My court was so happy and so was I because we've been practicing this dance forever. So two dances down and one last dance. Of course, my dad, the creator of these LED suits, had to help me. He wanted everything to look spectacular. Let's do it. Let's do it big. It was time to begin the last and the most shocking dance of all. As I was doing the dance, I messed up completely, forgot the last dance. 
Luckily, it was dark and there was LED lights, so anything I did looked good. I just kept moving and trying to make it look cool. I love the way you came out in the blue lights. Your performers were awesome. It was amazing. Whoever choreographed that did a great job. We just all started hugging and cheering, and it looked great. That was so good. Oh my god, you're like right now. Thank you. And now it was time to party. Happy birthday, Justine! This party was a beast! I love you! Even though planning my quince wasn't easy, and we had to do a lot of preparation for it, it was all worth it at the end. Having Erica there as my party planner, and having my family and friends to support me, was the most important thing to make a quince successful. I wish I could do it all over again. a 15.3.com para ver videos exclusivos, fotos de los 15 y hacer comentarios de lo que tú opinas. Y no te olvides de descargar el app Quiero Miss para que te ayude a planear tus 15 como siempre soñaste. Justine te invita a su VIP Quinces Live Chat para preguntarle todo sobre su Rave Quinces. ¿Cómo consiguió que Erika la ayudara con su fiesta y cómo hizo para aprenderse tantos bailes y que todas sus ideas se hicieron realidad? Solo sucederá hoy al final de este episodio y por una hora. Así que no te lo pierdas, entra a quinces.3.com. Justine te invita a su VIP Quinces Live Chat para preguntarle todo sobre su Rave Quinces. ¿Cómo consiguió que Erika la ayudara con su fiesta y cómo hizo para aprenderse tantos bailes y que todas sus ideas se hicieran realidad? Solo sucederá hoy por una hora y empieza ahora mismo. Así que no te lo pierdas y entra a quinces.3.com ya. After I woke up, I got up from my bed and went to go do my hair and makeup. Let's get ready. I started with my makeup first. I wanted my makeup natural because I don't like a lot of makeup. Ready? So once I got all my makeup done, I looked at myself in the mirror. Can you like it? Uh, I look like a man. <laughs> no, I don't like it. I don't know. I just, my face didn't go with it. I didn't like it at all. I felt like a drag queen.
excited. It's finally the day before my quintess and it's time for my final rehearsal. Hi everyone! Hey. As I walked into the venue with Erica, I saw my court and my choreographer already waiting for me. Okay, well then let's start. So then we did the grand entrance practice. Well, after we come in, you guys, y'all can go ahead and sit down. Justine is gonna stay here under the arch and basically she's just gonna greet her guests. We're gonna be randomly Present. random girls. Okay. Oh, hi. hi! Where's my present? Oh, <laughs> oh my god, I remember <laughs> seeing you when you were this little. Oh, oh my god. god. You see, that was good. Then it was time for the belly dance practice. Oh. And pick her up. It had to be perfect because they're not dropping me the day of my quintus. We are walking and the box would like go like that. And it's like we can't have her rolling out, you know? <laughs> so I'm sorry, I know it's heavy, but we need to get this perfect <laughs> okay. for tomorrow. So we had to do it again and again so everything was perfect. See, that looks so much better. Five, six, seven, eight. After that, we practiced the belly dance. I hope all our hard work finally pays off. And then it was time for the hip hop dance. I'm pretty confident that everything's gonna go well tomorrow. Tomorrow is the day. I'll see y'all in the morning and I'm very proud of you guys. Okay guys, good job, okay. I can't wait for all my friends and family to see all of our performances.